I'm drooling. <laughs> I don't dance. Come on. I don't dance. I know you care. Pray for me. Madura. Pray I find my way. Hey friends, there. Welcome back. I hope you're doing fantastic. Welcome to my channel. Welcome. My name is Zsoi Kamis Dubak J. Oh good. In today's video, we're going to be trying out the new NYX Strobe of Genius Illuminating Palette, as well as the NYX Lip Lingerie Lip Glosses. I was sent the Illuminating Palette as well as the lip glosses. So we're gonna play with it in today's video. If you get to join the fan base, make sure you subscribe down below, turn on notification, thumbs up this video, and without further ado, let's jump straight into it. So, NYX, NYX, one of my favorite brands out there. By the way, first of all, thank you so much, NYX Cosmetics Australia, for sending me this palette as well as the lip glosses. I really do appreciate it, okay? And apparently, the foundation, the NYX can't stop, won't stop. No, foundation is coming out in Australia in November, and they're bringing all the shades to Australia, like, I mean, that's what they said. I hope they're not lying. I mean, that's what they said on the social medias or whatever. And I'm just so excited I could cry. I can't believe they're bringing it all. Things have been changing lately here in Australia. It's really good. Like the other day we went to Target and I saw a black girl on the poster. I was like, Jesus, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. And the other day I saw a black female police officer and I was like, what what that was my first time seeing a black police officer in australia but and seeing a black female police that, anyway that's not what this video is all about and the other day i went to the store and i saw that there's a new darker shade of the laurea from the laura true match foundation there's now 10n or whatever it is in stores what anyway so thanks things are Sometimes I think things are changing and I'm really happy. So NYX, I cannot wait for the Cancer Wounds Foundation to come here, which is how I started, why I started saying everything I started saying. I, I'm just so excited guys. Like, and I, I can't wait to try out the foundation. So in about two months, it will be here and I'll try it out. Okay. All right. So let's jump into this one. <laughs> this is the NYX Strobe of Genius Illuminating Palette. This is the warm one. If you know me, if you've been watching my videos for quite some time now, you know that I have used the first one. I think this was the first one. The first Strobe of Genius palette, which I absolutely love. And the shade that I always go for is the one in the middle right here. I absolutely love this palette. I don't really touch the ones in the top row here because it's just, it's, 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 it's not, it's not for me, you know? So when I saw this one, when I opened the package and I saw this, I was like, hmm, this looks to be more melanin friendly girl. But then my excitement was short lived when I found out that this is limited edition why why you gotta do us like that i was really disappointed i mean why why did you have to make this limited edition next mm? why why here we go oh look at how pretty that looks and this is so beautiful this shade right here the one in the middle it's looking more white on camera it's it's more on the yellow side now they do have a description actually let me hold it side by side to the first one so here we go so this is the first one here right here and this is the second one which is the warm palette so this is the first shade in the palette it's a champagne gold oh that is so pretty the second one has a pink base they're saying it's rose oh that is just pretty i really like that yes the third one looks a bit deeper this is a deep bronze highlight let's watch the last one and the top row which is purple with blue violet pearl yes it, it, it has like this um it's like dual chrome shade it's just interesting do you see the shift? I hope you can see the shift. And the, the big ones in the bottom. And I, I really like the size of the pen, guys. The, the size, I show you the big ones at the bottom here. So the big ones in the bottom, the first one here is the shade Deep Rose Gold. Oh, oh, that is sizzling. I love that. And I'm wiping my finger in between, by the way. The middle one is the white gold. You see that? White gold. But when you're looking at it IRL, it's more on the yellow gold side. So it's yellow, white, gold type of shade. And the last one here is true gold. It's a horrible swatch, <laughs> but you get the gist. I love all the shades in here. Now, I don't know what shade I'm going to use, but let's just, let's start with one. Okay, let's start with one. Because I hardly go for the shades up here. Let me try and use this one right here. The purple with blue, violet, pearl, the dual chrome one. Just kind of pinkish. <sighs> oh, that is beautiful. 
That is beautiful. Do you? <gasps> oh, I'm drooling. <laughs> oh, like you would be looking at it. It almost looks kind of intimidating, but once you apply it, it just looks like that best friend you haven't seen in a long time, and you're so so happy to see. Let's let's put. I'm just gonna clean the brush. Let's use the second one, the rose color one. This one right here. Guys, honestly, the strobe of genius, I mean, they're both strobe of genius. The first one right here, I really, really love it. I love the formula and everything. And this one as well, the formula is still the same, you know? The, the shade is just better in this palette. I don't know. The shade in, this, in that one is good too, but I mainly focus on the middle one and the bottom. But this one right here, it looks like I can use all the shades here. Now, speaking of all the shades, let's use this yellow, white, gold one in the middle. And when you pick it up, you feel like, ooh, that looks ashy, but once you apply it, all your worries are gone, man. I'm telling you. Let's put it on top of this one. Oh, but this is so pretty. Oh, oh my goodness. Let me blend it out a bit. Because I've I overdid it. Did you see that cool shot? The way I just cut my my brush. It's awesome. Yes, you know what? Since I have this brush, I'm gonna pick up this pink one right here. Just a bit. I'm gonna try and use it as a blush now. This could be a disaster because it's it's a highlighter. But what's makeup if not pushing boundaries, you know? I was too scared I didn't grab anything. <laughs> grab way too much, but that is beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna grab a blending brush, just a smaller brush. Let's grab the deep brush. Mm, nah, let's not be boring. I use these kind of shades all the time, so I'm sure you all are used to it. I use that one too all the time as well. Let's use the white, yellow, white, white, yellow, gold. And put it everywhere else. <laughs> yes, yes. Yes, make me glow. They say me glowing. The hating. Woo! Let's grab the pink one, the one on the far end, and top it up in the inner corner a bit. I want a little bit more highlighter here. Okay, I've been here pl playing with highlighter for too long. I need to move on. We need to move on now. Oh, by the way, for my babes in Australia, it's available in November here in Australia. I'm sure it's been in the US for a long time and we just got it in now. That's usually the case, you know. Come on, glow. I can't focus. Anyway. Okay, so let's go in with the lip gloss. I've been going on about the lip gloss in my Insta story, guys. And I also mentioned in a recent video, the smoky brown eye video that I just did recently because I used two of the shades in that video. This is it. This is the lip gloss. This lip gloss, guys, is so, so beautiful. They feel so, so nice on the skin. They smell so good as well. And they last for hours, okay? And it's not just a regular gloss. They're pigmented gloss, literally. So if you want to pigmented gloss you know not too, too pigmented but pigmented compared to other glosses or whatever this is it okay and i do believe they said it's now available in australia hang on oh yeah it's now it's currently available in australia and i believe it's right in the us as well and this lip gloss i'm just reading the paper here so they have the gloss the shimmer and the glitter so i have two of each and apparently there's 27 glosses in this range you know 27 all together that covers the gloss shimmer and glitter so this is the glitter one this is a shade sable just smells so good it smells like a someone asked me on instagram in my instagram dm asking that what does it smell like it's hard for me to explain i don't know <laughs> i don't know what it smells like it just smells so good it's like a like a dessert i want to eat but it's not necessarily a dessert smell it's not a fragrance smell whatsoever it's a sweet smell it smells like something i want to eat it smells so good okay just go and try it out and check it for yourself i literally do not know how i'm gonna ex um, how i can explain it oh it, it smells is like what I imagine Idris Elba mixed with Dwayne Johnson and Vin Diesel, but mainly Idris Elba would smell like. Literally, that's what <laughs> I'm sorry, but I, I I cannot pinpoint it. Anyway, so let's watch Sable. You can see Sable has a lot of glitter. This is a glitter lip gloss. You see, it, this is a glitter, but it feels so good. And like, it just, it feels so comfortable. It's not like chappy or whatever. And it doesn't really like break down really weird throughout the day. And I just really like it. But I mainly like using the glitters as a topper on top of one of the other lip gloss. And I'll show you guys later what I mean by that. Actually, they have a description here. Thank God. So they're saying Sable is a mid-tone beige. Look at that. You wipe it off, it's all gone. 
you might have tiny little bit of glitters you know your lips where you can go in you can get it off and you're good mm. yes now let's swatch butter butter oh I think it tastes good too. And butter is described to be a toffee nude, and this is still in the glitter section. Ooh, butter, 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 hey, butter, butter, hey, butter, butter, I don't dance, come on. I don't dance, I know you can't. Oh, High School Musical, man. Yeah, butter is so pretty as well. These glitters are so pretty. So that's the glitter, that's the two glitters I have. Now with the shimmers, let's swatch Honeymoon. And Honeymoon is described to be a mauve pink. You see, this is not as shouty as the glitter ones. Well, it's it's just shimmery. It's not like glittery, it's shimmery, which is why it's a shimmer gloss. What are you saying, Nesta? Honeymoon, what I like to go on with Idris, girl. So here we go. Next one in the shimmer gloss is butter. You know how we have butter in glitter, in the glitter gloss? There's also butter in the shimmer one. This is also described to be a toffee nude. I keep smelling it every time and they all smell the same. <laughs> so this is butter. Yes! Butter, 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 butter. All right, so now for gloss gloss, we've got two, as I mentioned. We've got Spirit and Mason, or my son, Mason. I'm, let's just say Mason, man, okay? So let's swatch the lighter one, which is Spirit. And Spirit is just trying to be a nude pink gloss. I love this on top of Mason. I love combining it together. Mmm. <laughs> Ooh, it matches my inner corner i mean i wouldn't naturally wear this on its own like this because i looks like it looks like i have a baboon's butt on my face or whatever in a beautiful way i don't know how that can be beautiful you know what i mean so i really like combining it with mason um so let's just swatch mason now so you can see what i'm saying so this is mason described as a milk chocolate brown milk chocolate brown chocolate brown or chocolate brown <laughs> Oh. Do you see this chocolate? Oh, I feel like the brown is not showing as brown on camera for you babes. But it's more brown than it looks on camera right now. Just so beautiful. So now, let me show you all the combination I've been using lately. So now that I've got Mason on my lips, we've got chocolate brown on the lips. I'm gonna add a bit of mauve to it. I'm gonna use the shade Spirits in the gloss gloss. Just add it in the middle right here and also when you apply the gloss gloss you kind of have that cooling slash tingling sensation on your lips it's not unpleasant or anything you know but it's just it's nice so here we go oh do you see this look at how juicy my lip looks like it looks so juicy i don't even want to talk i'm drooling and it, it's easy to layer as well, by the way, in case you're wondering, because there's some gloss that you apply and just applies a little bit chunky. It's easy to layer. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> it's just beautiful. There's nothing I, I, there's nothing I don't like about this glosses you know the shimmers the glitters the gloss gloss they're all just so beautiful you know what i mean and look at this it's, my lips looks juicy okay let's add a bit of glitter on it we're not done i'm gonna grab the glitter gloss in the shade sable the mid-tone beige color and just tap it on top <sighs> honestly and the applicator is like a standard gloss applicator you know and it's soft as well actually i think it's like the applicator of the lip lingerie liquid lipstick oh okay lingerie lip liquid lipstick is um longer do you know what i mean oh imagine the combination of the lingerie liquid lipstick with this oh that would have, that would be so pretty all right babes here we are Whew. i've got different information of highlighters on my face and i'm loving it you know i've got pinkish white goldish somewhere champagne somewhere i've got some highlighters on my chest or my clavicle or decollete whatever it's called area in my in my shoulder girl <laughs> but anyway i really like the highlighting palette guys you guys know I don't know if you know that I do like the first Strip of Genius Humiliating Highlighting Palette, this one right here, but I believe this warm palette right here is more melanin friendly and if you're non -melan melanated melanin this would be great for you as well but honestly even for melanin peeps we can still work with this i use this almost all the time you know but i really like this one this new one i'm just really got it that it's limited edition i don't know why you're making something that looks to be more melanin friendly limited edition but i'm not gonna focus on that right now because i don't want anything to dampen my mood okay but i really like it okay and the lip glosses the glitter the shimmer 
about the gloss whoo i just look at how juicy it makes my lips look do you see i look my lips look so juicy you know i really like those glosses beautiful you're beautiful and i'm not just saying these because they send it to me i really like nyx products most nyx products not all of it you guys know i've shared the nyx products that i don't like with you guys yeah you know that i do not allow anything to stop what i'm gonna say like my face always tells it all as well anyway because my reaction is on my face so i'm not saying all these nice things because they send it to me because y'all know no i'm not about to sell my soul for that okay integrity is very important to me but i'm telling you I really like these glosses for me. They, they work for me and I have no doubts that they're gonna work for you. And if they don't, I don't know why it wouldn't. It would work for you, okay? So that's all I've got for this next video, okay? That's all I've got for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I know we only tried two products, but I wanted to do a dedicated video on the highlighting palette and the glosses because the highlighting palette is in my set edition. I wanted to get it out for you babies, especially Australian based because because we're only just getting it now and I'm pretty sure it's already in the US already. I'm not sure, but I think it's, already, it's probably already in the US, okay? So I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up. Today's fandom shout out is is AML Adulting. That is your YouTube name. I don't know. But I just want to say thank you so much for commenting on my recent video. Thank you so much for the love and support and for hyping me up in the comments. I really appreciate it. Okay. And I did tell my sisters and Vincia what now, you know, what you said. And I showed them your comments. So they appreciate it as well. And they say thank you. Thank you, Fanbem, for watching my video and for your continuous support. I appreciate every single one of you, babes. And as always, whatever it is, love yourself. And I'll see you guys in my very next video. Bye. Lip glosses, which I've lost. Oh, it's right in front of me. It was right here. Hang on. The hell? Why you gotta do like that? US price right here. Ah, the shimmer glosses. Now, where are the glosses? I keep losing them. I keep staying at myself. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. I'm not sorry. <laughs> Ooh. Hold on. They don't love you like I love you. Why am I holding butter? I keep losing it. Where's Mason? I keep losing it.